your body will heal itself. It knows what to do. Yeah. You just got to feed it every day, get in the habit. You know, this addiction is a bad habit, so uh, you got to overcome it, you know, with a good plant-based herb, herbal supplement program, bring uh -huh. enough water every day, exercise, get some sunshine, you know, go, go hiking. What better way to ring in the triple digits than with my good friend here, who I've known for over five years now. Welcome back everybody to the Healthy Habit Podcast. I'm your host, Dr. Dejan Matijevic of Healthy Habit Medical Center. And episode number 100 is today, folks. Episode number 100. What better way to ring in the triple digits than with my good friend here, who I've known for over five years now, Mr. Spencer Masterson, folks, is with us, who's the president and founder of New Life Herbs. That's newlifeherbs.com, N-U-lifeherbs.com. Spencer Masterson is the formulator of the unique herbal formulas found at New Life Herbs. He's a master herbalist and author of Discover the Five Treasures for Better Health, a great book, which I have a copy of that myself, by the way. He's dedicated to natural healing through herbs and other natural alternative methods. Spencer received his Master's of Herbology at Dr. John R. Christopher's School of Natural Healing. He enjoys teaching about herbs and how they can heal the body. And one of Spencer's missions there at New Life Herbs is to provide superior natural formulas that relieve stress heal the body, prevent disease, and maintain optimal health. So you tuned into a good one here, folks. I've, I've been waiting for this episode. We haven't talked to Spencer yet on the podcast medium. Welcome, Spencer, episode 100. Yeah, it's good to be here with you, doctor. I'm excited, buddy. Number 100, who could have who could have we had better than you to, to ring in this triple-digit episode? So I'm holding a bottle right here of... It's going to be hard with the background there, the green screen there. The Metabolizer Adrenal Support Sugar Blocker Formula with Gymnema and Maca. I've taken many of Spencer's herbal products. He always brings a good, unique blend of herbs together. Like in this formula, we have fenugreek, ginger, cayenne, maca, licorice. So this is the guy you want to talk to, folks, when it comes to herbs. Spencer, what made you want to launch your own herbal company? Well, I grew up in a household. My mother was into herbs and she had diabetes. And so she you know, had a good diet of mostly being a vegetarian and yeah. uh, whole foods and herbs. And she, she met Dr. Christopher and I tagged along with her when I was a teenager and met Dr. Christopher, you know, the famous John R. Christopher, oh, yeah. Utah, master herbalist. He's a naturopathic doctor, like you, doctor. And, uh, he wanted to heal people with, by eating whole foods and herbs and cleansing and nourishing the body. He was really into cleansing the liver, the colon, the bloodstream, and purifying the body. When it becomes pure, then the body can come back together and regenerate the cells and the glands and the organs to, to come back into balance again and heal. So, so I, I got interested since I was a teenager to become a nervous myself. So in 93, I enrolled, became a, enrolled, went to the School of Natural Healing. And uh, in 96, graduated the Master Herbalist. Yeah. And uh, became a Master Herbalist. So I, here I am, uh, educating people. I formulated some herbal supplements and sold to health food stores and online and you know, do some coaching. Uh, coach people how to heal themselves because nobody can do it, right? So yeah. So here I am. This that's how I got my start. And Spencer just celebrated his 104th birthday. Is that correct, Spencer? He looks great. Yeah, 68 years <laughs> young. <laughs> no, nah, just uh, those herbs are are working miracles for you, my friend. We've gone hiking. I've gone on multiple hikes with Spencer. He keeps us going here folks that healthy habit we miss his demos here at the store many people have known about spencer over the years here through healthy habit health foods and uh spencer why was uh dr christopher so obsessed with cayenne pepper by the way i know you like including that herb in in different formulas yeah yeah i do i i got the metabolizer my 
men's and women's formula to kind of help the herbs accelerate through the circulation circulatory system. And uh, yeah, I got my wheatgrass even, you know, with the wheatgrass juice powder, the wheatgrass formula seven. Uh, the stress formula I don't dream on because that kind of you don't want too much energy trying to relax and, and try to sleep. So right. I hear mostly just a little bit of trace of cayenne to help circulation. So it's a good blood mover. It helps move blood. It's anti-inflammatory, right, with pain too? Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yep. With any kind of pain, uh, you know, anxiety, headaches. You know, yeah. Stuff like that. So yeah, it's it's amazing, amazing for me. It's got high in vitamin C, you know, all the minerals, and uh, yeah, it's the, it's a go-to herb to help, like you say, inflammation, pain, and circulatory system. Yes, sir. Spencer, tell us about your your five pack. I hope I'm saying that correct. The five pack addiction program that you just recently launched and uh, has been helping a lot of people. Tell us about your addiction pack. Yeah, because I, I sit down one day years ago, I thought, you know what, people are addicted to like soda pops, too much coffee, and, and uh, you know, cigarettes, alcohol, beer, mm. uh, pharmaceuticals, and all these addictions, food addiction, too much meat, dairy, processed foods, you know, processed foods is like one of the worst, you know, fake foods you can eat, right? Because it has yeah. processed sugars and oils and salt and all that it's gmo so i created uh five products you know the first product is a uh, is a plant-based hemp protein with organic grains you know the hemp protein is the building blocks of you know amino acids to uh build the yeah. muscle and to build our bodies up and you know you know wheat grasses in there chlorella spirulina those greens helps alkalize the body to become more alkaline because you know addicted people with all the processed sad american diet they're they're too acidic so we want we want to become more alkaline alkaline our bodies more and when you're alkaline you have no health problems or no disease right or illness right so it's all about the ph balance you know alkaline is it you know 7.2 that's where we want to be to become healthy and build our bodies up, our immune system and all that. So that's the protein. And the second one is the wheatgrass. That was my, actually my first formula over 30 years ago. I had bad allergies for over 16 years. Right. And so I read a book that my mother had on wheatgrass. So I, I go, wow, I wonder if that helped my allergies and get me in better shape. So I started, went to the healthy store and got, I ordered some wheatgrass online well, not online because 93 they didn't have any. For 92 they didn't have any websites. Yeah. Back then. So I went to the healthy store and bought cayenne pepper, slippery elm, peppermint leaf. And then I ordered uh, some wheatgrass powder, started mixing it in my kitchen, bought some capsules, uh, a capsule tray. And then that's, that's how I come up with wheatgrass formula seven. And I started taking it every like twice a day and then after about a week i go i'm not sneezing and itching my eyes as much yeah after about three weeks my allergies were like gone i thought wow this is a miracle <laughs> now that has all the nutrients the minerals the chlorophyll if i knew about the ph balance i found out later it, it, it balanced out my my acidic state into alkaline state and so that's that's what happened with the wheatgrass. And so I started marking that one product to health food stores all over the valley, in Utah, Las Vegas, you know, New Mexico, Albuquerque, and all that. And so that's that was my go-to, you know, first formula, wheatgrass formula seven. So I put that in with addiction, because you know, if you get more alkaline, then you're not gonna have any addiction. So you have right. the protein, the wheatgrass. Third one is that metabolizer that you showed everyone in the beginning is the sugar blocker because if you can block sugar cravings then you're not going to eat so much processed foods yeah and uh 
And so that one works really good. It's a drill support. I put licorice fruit in there that helps support the drenals. Because, you know, that's one of the most important glands is our adrenals because that creates energy and helps your metabolism. Yeah. Uh, so that's a really go-to herb there, the, uh, uh, the licorice fruit. Uh-huh. So the, the maca helps the metabolizer. It helps hormone balancing, the metabolizer. That's a really good one for weight loss if you try to lose weight and helps the adrenals. Then the, uh, the fourth one is the, uh, the liver cleanse. The liver colon. I put liver colon parasite tree cleanses in one. Yeah. So it's easy to do. It's all in one. It's less expensive. So that's the liver colon parasite cleanse. You know, dandelion roots in there, which helps clean up the liver. A lot of Americans, fat American diet, they're, they got fatty liver because they eat too much processed meats, dairy, cause a lot of mucus. Yeah. Process sugar causes mucus. So that goes right to the liver. Your first organ in your digestive system is your gut, your liver. And the last is your colon. So a lot of the meat and dairy and processed foods you get clogged up in the colon. So this, these herbs in there in the, in the colon cleanse helps push it out so you have a better bowel movement because we need more you know, bowel movements every day. Yeah. So if you eat two or three meals, you need at least two bowel movements a day, right? So so that's the liver colon parasite cleanse. And then the, the fifth one is the uh, is the stress limiter. And you're taking that one for stress, anxiety. I got people off antidepressants, medications with the stress because it helps with the serotonin levels to balance out the serotonin hormone. Yeah. So it helps the nervous system, helps nourish the nervous system. In that for me, you got the passion flower, chamomile, hops flower, and uh, those flower herbs helps the nervous system, helps you relax more. Uh huh. Well, that's the go to with the stress, anxiety. Yeah. Nervous. So oh, it helps you a- focus. Good for the brain, Chip. I go to Cole in there for the brain. Uh huh. So think better more clarity in your thinking and uh makes yeah. you smart so that's I, why i'm so smart i take it every day that's right smartest guy i know right here there you go this is the good lineup right here we got the metabolizer liver colon parasite cleanse the protein right here which has been in our store for years now people love this protein right here he had a he had a new label that was put on all these products spencer did in the last couple of years the wheatgrass this is the original as Spencer was mentioning, the wheatgrass formula seven, and then of course the stress eliminator. That last one's important, Spencer, because when people are getting off addictions, they have a lot of anger, irritability, their nerves are on high wire, you know, they're on high alert, and they can't sleep. Different types of detoxing uh, symptoms that happen when people are getting off an addiction, whatever it is. In this case, we have the addiction wellness program, folks, the five pack through New Life Herbs, and this is a program to assist those who have addictions to chemical substances such as drugs, different medications, people that are over-medicated, uh, alcohol, nicotine, caffeine, sugar cravings, processed foods, meats, dairy, or just overeating in general. That's an addiction in and of itself. Spencer, I was telling people in 1970, we had uh, 2,100 calories per day on average per person, 2,100, 50 years ago. Now it's about 3,700 a day per person in America on average. That's almost double the amount of calories. Yeah, wow, that's a lot. Yeah. Isn't that interesting? Overeating, yeah, we need to undereat. Like, I was fasting yesterday 24 hours. All all I did is took took my herbs. Yeah. Took a teaspoon of my my protein. It gave me enough nutrients. I wasn't hungry all day, drank plenty of water. Uh Uh-huh. That was... That satisfied me. Here I'm going my second day fast with my herbs, and uh, I feel great. Folks, head over head over to newlifeherbs.com. You can see the spelling up here if you're tuning in to just audio only, Spotify. Then N-U, N as in Nancy, U, lifeherbs.com, newlifeherbs.com. You can check the shop there. 
Spencer has an online coaching course there. He teaches you how to exercise, get you on a good fitness plan. He has coaching, one-on-one -on -one coaching with Spencer Master, Masterson, Master Herbalist. That's great. He has master in his last name, and he's a master herbalist. Look how he was meant to be, right, Spencer? There you go. I'm related to the master himself. Amen on that. Your, ba your body naturally wants to heal. Your job is to give it what it needs and step out of the way. Love that quote right there. And that's what Spencer, that's where he shines. He gives your body the tools that it needs to help the healing process happen. Is that right, Spencer? Is that a good way of looking at it? Exactly, yeah. You got to take the right uh, ingredients and your body will heal itself. It knows what to do. Yeah. You just got to feed it every day, get in the habit. You know, this addiction is a bad habit, so uh, you got to overcome it. You know, with a good plant-based herb, herbal supplement program, bring uh -huh. enough water every day, exercise, get some sunshine, you know, go go hiking. So yeah. I be with nature, deep breathing. We need more oxygen in our, our, our cells needs oxygen and water. That's what they need and live on. They thrive on all that oxygen and water. So that's what my go-to is. Stay healthy is oxygen, water, light exercise, and uh, sunshine, vitamin D. It's all natural. It's from nature, go well, back to nature the way we're designed to live, yeah. and we'll thrive to over 100 years old and never have a, ever have a sickness. Just go and see Dr. Dan once a year and say, hey, go wow. check it out. Where am I at? Yeah, once a year, pop in for a blood draw, see, see how we're doing. Exactly. So yeah. your original formula, I want to go back to that real quick. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. The wheatgrass seven, the superfood formula, which has some cayenne in there, but we haven't talked about wheatgrass on the Healthy Habit podcast, Spencer, with anybody else, really. At least not like a major highlight of it. Maybe we mentioned it in passing here and there, but why yeah. should everyone consider wheatgrass? One of the old school, one of the old school supplements in this world of natural medicine, herbal medicine. There was Dr. Christopher. He was a big proponent. I forget the female, the lady's name, that she was a major proponent of. Can you remind me? Yeah. You know, Ann Wigmore. There we go, Ann Wigmore. Hippocrates. Hippocrates started in Boston, then they moved to Florida. They have a great resort. People go there and eat live whole foods, mostly raw. They yeah. They use wheatgrass, take shots during the day, even uh, wheatgrass, you know, enemas and stuff like that. So... So it's pretty cool. You can just flush out all the garbage and poison in your body and, and heal yourself with wheatgrass because it has your 100 trace minerals. Can you believe that? Calcium, magnesium, all those 100 trace minerals. Wow. It's all wheatgrass. That's fascinating. And it says here on your website, grasses in general contain high concentrations of natural chlorophyll. What's the importance of chlorophyll? Why is that? So, such an important part of taking wheatgrass. You know, like our blood, you know, it's got the, uh, the building blocks of, you know, our blood needs minerals. And, you know, like the plants is green blood. It's the blood yeah. fills the green blood of the plants, right? Uh -huh. Our blood is red, so when we put the green blood of the plants in our bloodstream, and you get all these amazing minerals and and uh, it alkalize changes the pH to more alkaline. So we need to become more alkaline balanced, like I said before. We need to be more alkaline, we need plenty of chlorophyll. So greens has the chlorophyll and wheatgrass is high concentration of chlorophyll that contains all these minerals and and uh, phytonutrients that our body needs. To, to build our body up. Wow. And and you don't need much wheatgrass, like for example, when you eat other foods, you have a big plate of food. Wheatgrass is so concentrated, right? So you don't need massive buckets of it, huge amounts to be consumed, correct? Yeah, like three capsules in the morning and three in the evening. Six uh -huh. a day equals about like 15 pounds of, uh, of greens, of vegetables. Wow. Vegetables, that's how concentrated wheatgrass is, like vegetables. 
like yeah. you know, 10 to 15 pounds. So there you go. You get enough for three capsules a day of the chlorophyll, the minerals, even the fiber. And the, I, get, I do wheatgrass juice powder, wheatgrass uh, leaf. So two wheatgrasses all in. Okay. Yeah, if we, if we look at the first ingredient here, it's the it's the juice powder from organic wheatgrass. And then number two here is the actual leaf crushed up in there, correct? Exactly. Yeah. Amazing. That's good. Yeah. That's and then <clears throat> why did you choose to combine this with slippery elm and peppermint? Well, you know, slippery elm is, uh, you know, what it does, it helps clean up the intestines. Yeah. Mucus. You know, people... You know, cause of heart disease and cancer and type 2 diabetes and obesity, a few extra pounds, I say. Uh -huh. It's the mucus. You eliminate the mucus, you eliminate the, co the cause, right? So mucus is great for cleaning up the intestines, the colon, yeah. the gut, the lining of the gut. So you need slippery on. That's why I put that in there. That's why it's so effective, too, with the wheatgrass. Then add peppermint. You know, peppermint is, you know, it smells so good. It's aromatherapy, and it's high in vitamin C. And peppermint leaf has chlorophyll in it too. So, I love it. I used to have a peppermint uh, garden in Mesa when I first started my business in '93. Uh huh. I go out there and water it. You can smell this aroma. Oh man, it was so good. Peppermint leaf. Oh my gosh. You open up a bottle. I go like that, take a big whiff of it, and that's uh, <laughs> peppermint leaf. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit of cayenne. So, you know, what cayenne does help circulation. So there you go. That's the, that's the formula of the actions of the, uh, the herbs in the wheatgrass formula seven. Uh -huh. So Spencer, what keeps you going here? We got about six minutes to go. What, what's keeping you getting up every day and being inspired to help people what's keeping you fueled up well you know my mom had type 2 diabetes you know she she actually passed away at a young age of 49 years old even though she ate right with the insulin you know it's synthetic it uh, caused her to be blind and uh, her heart gave up and she had a heart attack and she was gone I was only 25 years old and I thought god man if I if I I just knew kind of what my mom knew, and then I, my mind went back to no. that seminar with Dr. Christopher, and I go, yeah, Dr. Christopher, he'd travel all over the country trying to educate us and all that guy. I thought, if I could be an educator like Dr. Christopher and my mother, I'd go, man, I'd, I'd get it out to the world. So that's what my passion is, to get it out to the, the masses and uh, through this interview of you, doctor, thanks for having me on. To get it out to people to wake them up and say, hey, wake up. You shouldn't have any kind of illness. If you do get a little cold once a year, that's good. But, but you know, you shouldn't be sick of all these freaking diseases in America. So wow. that's why I do what I do. That's why I love coaching people, share it with people, you know, wake them up, get exercising. I do for exercise, I do a little bit of rebounding, you know, helps the lymph nodes. Because things yeah. move in the morning. That's what I do in the morning. I get excited. Go, yeah, let's go heal some, heal people and, and get them going again. Uh -huh. so that's, my, that's what I do. My go-to is, you know, positive attitude. We need the right mindset, train our minds. Yeah. Think, think positive. Get out there and and go go to it. So that's my that's my love, really. My my mother, my sister. Yeah. He ended up yeah. getting. Uh, you know, cancer, she passed away at age 53, so I was sad about that. Mm. Went the chemo route, did the naturopathic route, the herbless route, so I try to pe wake people up about, hey, you don't need to go to a medical doctor unless you're, you get run over by a train or something, and you need to go, but a naturopathic doctors and a herbless work together, you can heal the problem. So All that's right. my method, my, my thinking is, Go natural as much, much as possible. Go see a naturopathic doctor, a doctor Dan, and uh, and be healed. You don't need to be sick. Right. So that's my story. Incredible. We'll finish off 
highlighting new new life herbs one more time again that's n u life l i f e herbs dot com spencer's located over in mesa arizona you can give them a call also at 1-800-720-4727 that's 1-800-720-4727 and i'll leave that uh, link below as well I'll leave that information in the description box below Folks, start a plant-based diet and exercise program with Spencer Masterson. He only uses whole food herbs in his formulas. Why is that so important? We'll finish on that note, Spencer. What does that mean, whole food herbs? Well, that means it's not extracted, it's not standardized, and it's not oh. processed. It's like the natural state, like eating an apple. You know what? Oh. I mean? Well, apple's got fiber, vitamin C, vitamin D, and and uh, all these minerals. You want it all a whole Wholesome food, that's what that means, wholesome. Keep it natural state and organic. You know, they're all organic herbs and the wheatgrass all organic, the protein, hemp protein's all organic. We want it organic like our ancestors back hundreds of years ago, it's all organic. They yeah. had no processed foods and all that nonsense. Now we have all that processed inorganic, we need to do as much organic as possible and put it in our bodies so our bodies will thrive. So that's why I use wholesome foods, organic wholesome foods in my product. Incredible, Spencer. Great place to end it there, folks. If this resonated with you, reach out to Spencer. Go to his website. You can message him through there. We also carry all of his products right here at Healthy Habit Health Foods, 6029 North 7th Street, right on the corner of Bethany Home Road and 7th Street. We're going to have Spencer on for a part two here in a couple weeks. Spencer, thanks for coming on for episode number 100, my good friend. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. It's been nice to share my knowledge and, and uh, connect with you again. Well, we're just getting started, my friend. We will talk to you next time. Thanks again, Spencer. All right. Go plant strong. Let's do it. Let's go.